Uh, so welcome back guys my name is Amlan and in today's make knowledge free campaign we go about looking at how we can disable ads from all our android apps and even the websites that we use so i really figured this out after a lot of research and i say this with authority that really the ads get disabled at least on my samsung m30 and i will show you with proof well as of now first go ahead and type on your browser fdroid ad blocker and you actually need to go down until you see something called as DNS something yeah. DNS 66 so this works at the DNS level and which is pretty good so like just let's go and see what it writes here so you can see that this blocks hostname via DNS and this can be used for ad blocking it also allows other DNS servers to be added for more privacy so if you know of various different domain name servers from where you are getting ads you can add on to that list but i think the ones which are there by default works pretty good so okay as you go down like the package which you need to install is actually this one so version 0.6.1 download apk just go ahead and download this so you'll see that i already have downloaded this i will go ahead and install this right now so uh, in case you have settings which don't allow you to install applications third party applications you go ahead and you allow this don't worry it's a trusted one and it's open source and it's much more secure than any other such app even if it's using vpn since the vpn is being done at a dns level so you are pretty secure and it's not intruding on your privacy so the app has been installed you can click on open so this is how it would look like at the start now this is what it looks like let's see what we can do here so the one thing that you need to do is you need to click on host and this are like the different hosts which you can enable uh, for blocking ads i typically found that only this one solves my case add away host file the other when you try to enable may create some conflict so it's better to have this enabled and then again go ahead on the start thing and then like just refresh this and then actually click on start and you can see that this application is requesting to set up a VPN connection. So you can go ahead and you can allow this. Don't worry, nothing will happen. And you can see now it's started. So this tick indicates that it's started. You can anytime again decide to stop. You can simply do this and you can click on start like this. So I mean, I hope that this helps you understand that this has now started this icon at the top, which is now reflective of the fact that the ad blocker has been turned on. Okay, now so far so good. Now let me just check with the app actually, you know, uh, uh, I will check uh, body temperature. So this one, it actually had a lot of ads coming after I checked my body temperature through this app. So I'll just go ahead and uh, uh, I will see if there is anything no and I can see there is no I mean as of now there is no uh, ads coming so which is pretty good I mean so this is what I was wanting to say like you know like now anytime you use an app you actually don't see any ads coming earlier there was a lot of ads coming even when i was actually checking you know like suppose i put my finger and check my body temperature so after the temperature would come on the screen this is a free app and you know how it is like typically for the results to be shown on the screen you will have the ad coming first and then like you know the results were getting displayed so now there is no ads coming which is very very good and i think it really works you can try it out you can let me know in the comment section where it's working for you you have just seen like how in this application it's uh like uh, working and i therefore believe that it really does work so basically again i will just uh, kind of uh, let you know what we did we went and this application is called dns something dns uh just a moment yeah i'll put a link to the uh, this application on my description so that you can check this so once this application has been downloaded what you can do is you can click on the host file you can enable this add away host file then click on start just refresh so that the settings take effect once you do that it will be like this at the start then you can click on start so that this is running and this works on the system level so implying that if you are the browser if you are using any 
application it will work at all levels i think it works pretty well some people are complaining that in their devices it's not working but i think if you use it correctly it should work pretty well no matter which application or which website you are using so hopefully this is an immensely useful tutorial because i really was very perturbed and disturbed when i was using applications and you you know how hard it is so in case you find this useful please don't mind subscribing to our channel also please click on the bell icon so that you keep getting notifications when we upload our tutorials and i hope uh, my voice is good and yeah, i i could get the point across god bless goodbye